Here's Hardy. Hardy. Back to Daniels. Dyson Daniels. The bottom. Dyson Daniels, 18 years old, from Australia, drains it. Did you have a favorite team when you're growing up? OKC okay, was my favorite team, you know, growing wow. up a Russell Westbrook fan, you know, when um, Paul George, Russell Westbrook, those people were there. You know, I love watching them play and, you know, now Giddy's there, I will still say OKC okay, is my favorite team. So, yeah. but, um, you know, I love watching all the teams, just how they play, but I'd say OKC okay, is my main one. What is up, Thunder fans? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new around here, I make content about the young rising stars and coming through the league. And today we're talking about Dyson Daniels, a fella who was born in the exact same town that I was born in. Bendigo, Australia, this kid is going to be something special and let's talk about it. He's a 19 year old 6 foot 7 shooting guard, he's projected to go number 7th in the draft to Portland, well I hope he drops to Oklahoma, he wants to go to Oklahoma, he's a big fan of OKC, so that'll be an amazing pick for us, but the chances of actually getting him are pretty slim, but you never know, he could drop to the 12th pick. This kid is ranked 3rd amongst all other shooting guards, this kid is highly talented, his stats don't actually jump straight out at you, but let's have a look at him. Daniels averaged 11.5 points, 4.5 assists, and 6 rebounds a game while playing amazing defense. He almost averaged about a block a game and almost 2 steals a game. That is amazing defense and he's, he's so quick, he's so versatile, this kid can do it all out there. Now let's get into his strengths and weaknesses. Now on the screen here I've taken a snapshot of Tankathon's strengths and weaknesses for Dyson Daniels and here you can clearly see that offensive rebounds, assists, uh, assist to turnover ratio, his blocks, his rebounds are really all great for him and here's a couple of his uh, negatives. He's not the best scorer, he's not the best three point shooter from NBA range and his turnovers could improve but this kid has a lot of room to grow. He will, he will excel, he will learn, he's a great um, student of the game. He loves it, absolutely loves it. And this kid's got a lot of potential. I can see him improving in all areas. He's sort of like what Dante Exum could have been for Australia. But this kid's the next best thing for Australia and for the NBA. I can guarantee it. You, hear, you heard it here first. The kid's probably going to win Rookie of the Year. Watch it, listen to it. Here it is. This is facts. All right, guys, that's enough from me. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please leave a like. You don't have to, but it'll be really appreciate it. Drop a comment what you guys think of Dyson because I honestly think he's Australia's next best thing. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you guys are into it. You guys don't have to, but I do appreciate it. Thanks, guys. All right, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one, and peace out. But I could see why. Bochamp to Daniels. Dyson Daniels up to Bochamp with authority. Back and forth first half in Vegas. Two point game, two and a half left. Daniels got it to go.